tell you what. I'm so irritated on how management and property managers treat you when your financial obstacles because of the pandemic are not your fault. But what they do is irritate the hell out of you all day. And I have an example I'll show you guys. No matter, like, no matter what's going on, what day, this woman irritates the crap out of me. All day, every day. things there in the white bag or in my plant garden which is there to my left she's watering and then what she'll do is she'll come back over here and she'll water all of my windows my porch I constantly have watermarks on my floor I'm too exhausted to yell. I'm just tired of people being so absolutely rude for absolutely no reason. I do nothing to you. I don't speak to you at all. We don't even speak the same language. So my motivation of the day is I'm going to do a, a full on, I'm gonna call it a FU meditation. <laughs> um, for the lack of, it's gonna be for fruition. Fruition. I don't know what the U will stand for, but I just figure it's it's probably best to do something where you channel, or not channel, but you conjure the light from your chi energy, and you spontaneously are going to combust it to your surroundings, because <clears throat> I've been trying to understand and figure out why is everything frustrating me right now. And things are frustrating because when there's chi energy in the body, what happens is if we don't release it, it becomes tension, it becomes anxiety, it becomes stress. And I realized this yesterday night. I was with a friend and the friend was drinking coffee. And... Um, uh, the amount of coffee that my friend had, and it was like uh, four of us. So three of us had like, you know, water. One person had uh, Dr. Pepper, but this friend had too much coffee. So he was kind of jittery and shaky and blah, blah, blah. Um, I decided to Reiki the friend who was drinking too much coffee and by doing the Reiki, not only did I accidentally absorb <laughs> the emotions, but I came to the realization that uh, well, our conversation that came up was about politics. And the main person, Coffeehead, uh, brought up politics. And so it made me think, hey... While I was raking him, what conjured through him was his frustration about President Trump. I'm like, look, it's already over. Why are you bringing it up? <laughs> you 
you got what you wanted. Why are you bringing it up? But the fact that I refused to say I was a Democrat was frustrating him. And it wasn't like I was saying I'm a Republican, but I just kept saying I'm not a Democrat. I think differently. Long story short, um, his, uh, where am I in my thought process? Oh, I was creating tension and frustration uh, out of the dialogue because I felt like if he doesn't release what is lingering in his chi, in his solar plex area, in the chakra of the solar plexus, um, what happens is everything below gets blocked. So therefore, we can never ground ourselves. If you guys understand the chakra system, if your sacral and your root are blocked, you will constantly have cycles of makeup, breakup, um, let's say with your sexual organs, you will have a lot of touch and go situations, hit and run situations, people that will not stay, people who are disappointed, um, and pity sex. <laughs> Sorry to be before your root chakra. Basically, you will never have, um, any anchor in a direction that you're trying to go. So, like, let's say for my my situation, um, I'm here without work. I am sitting here. I guess we're still in a pandemic. Um, financial hardship due to um, due to being in lockdown status because of the virus. Um, not knowing which angle and direction to go. So that has a lot to do with my own personal um, uh, solar plex chakra blockage. Um, so that's what I'm going to do today. I'm going to do a meditation because a lot of things are pushing me and pushing Bonquisha to make a explosion of an FU to this, this native energy. Through <laughs> fruition meditation yes so I'm going to be innovating that and every day this week I'm going to be doing a live stream on this FU meditation because I'm getting tired of the reality controlling us the, and it's funny how the reality is has no it has no like tangibility within your own you know sacred space or your home you know um, the blue light is is for calming purposes to stay calm <laughs> if you guys didn't know that um, blue light therapy look it up when people constantly are agitating you while you're trying to be on your path of doing something uh, you can never complete what your objective or mission is so then there's a reset and i've li i've been realizing that this whole i'm trying to think and talk at the same time because i just realized it and i like to create videos and speak as soon as these things come to my mindset um because i'll forget later and it's not authentic if i don't release it but I was just giving you guys the example of what's happening outside. And just trying to realize why is somebody scrubbing my porch? When A, they don't, they don't know me. <laughs> but I'm understanding what I'm attracting is, is more on a universal level <clears throat> where I have to rise above. I have to rise above that. And I have to ascend myself higher. And it's kind of hard when you are in a situation where the frequency of 
the, the country is <laughs> at its lowest, but we have hope. So yes, each day this week, I will be posting meditations on uh, releasing the chi energy out of the solar plex chakra. That's also where the uh, virus is nesting itself. I also just realized this too. I have noticed how being gluten-free allows you to uh, purge. Allows you to purge. Um, the aff- afflictions and the things that are lingering in your stomach. A lot of immune system uh, dysfunctions, free radicals, uh, bacteria, viruses. I say viruses already. But things like that, they rest in your fatty acids of your stomach. This is why we get acid reflux. Because it's trying to come out. It's trying to come up. And <clears throat> the big issue with um, acid reflux is it's a chakra imbalance. Follow me, follow me. Because it's the solar plexus that are blocked and it's so much affliction here that it starts to interrupt what's supposed to happen in the upper chakras. So anyways, that's all I want to share with everybody. I will be back later with a uh, meditation video. Have a great morning. (laughs) I just woke up and I'll talk to you later.